Do you think that this is the best Real Madrid that we've seen for a while? He said, yeah, I think so. We, we fought until the end of this game. What's up, guys? Welcome to Real Madrid Fan TV. And today, we're going to react to Benzema's post-match interview and also some of the take of Benzema of CBS Sports Panelist. And let's see what they say. And I'll give my reaction to this. ...to the media after the game. Here you go. Journalist asks him, how long would you like this feeling to last, the one that you're feeling right now? He says, a lot of time, a long time. It's been magical, just like it was at the Bernabeu against PSG. Today we came to this, to this game to win it. We wanted to play like Real Madrid play. Things went extremely well for us. We played well. It, and we played this game to the, to the final minutes of it. It had that magical moment against PSG. And do you think that this is the best Real Madrid that we've seen for a while? He said, yeah, I think so. We, we fought until the end of this game. We came here to win it. And, and this was the same for us today. Which goal made you happier today, the journalist asked him. Which is the one that, that makes you most satisfied that you scored? He says all three. They're all three important, and that's all there is to say. I think probably the third one, though, because I had missed one at the, at the end of that first half. So it's always important to put a, a goal in the back of the net, so probably it's the third one I'm really happy with. Um, so here, here are two key points Benzema made in this interview. Uh, first of all, what he said is that this is how we should play. Absolutely, I agree. This is how we should play. We should never sit back and just defend. This is how attacking football that we should play every match. The second point he, he also said that is this the best match Real Madrid played so far? He said yes. I absolutely agree. This is one this is the best match of this season. Karim Benzema, another big performance, and we just keep seeing him again and again come up clutch in these games that really matter. It was interesting talking about, you were talking about him earlier, saying how, you know, Cristiano Ronaldo really enjoyed playing alongside a Karim Benzema because he wasn't selfish. But now Karim Benzema is, is really enjoying an ability to be selfish and get those goals. Exactly, but he makes both, you know. He also, in Spanish leagues, is the best assistant. So he does everything now, and he enjoys uh, the pressure. The pressure is now on him to score the most goals. There's no Ronaldo, there's no Ronaldo. So, but, but it's unbelievable when we spoke about how energetic they were and everything. It's unbelievable how much confidence as a team you have when you have somebody in that form like he is having now. Do you think he feels loved? Of course he feels loved. All the I mean, yeah, I totally agree with him that Benzema is playing different level than he used to play with Ronaldo. To be honest, at that time, he had totally different role. So it makes sense. Love, he's, he's, a, ma he's a main <laughs> man. Come in, I'm sorry! <laughs> <laughs> so he's doing apology to Benzema, but he doesn't look honest, Mika. Is he up to hurricane yet, Mika? <laughs> uh, uh, look, look at that. Wow. I mean, 82 goals Look at this in Champions League. It's just astonishing numbers. Obviously, Ronaldo and Messi out of this world, but Benzema. Yeah, the last couple of uh, games, and those games are, are not against Villarique. Those games are against Paris Saint-Germain and against Chelsea. Yeah. Top. Yeah, it's not. Some people say Benzema isn't a big team player. Come on. He scored hat-trick against PSG and now Chelsea. Come on. Teams, they can't be any better. No disrespect to Billy Two hat tricks. No, 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 no. <laughs> Two hat tricks. Scary. No, scary. 